All right, so I have been putting this video off for quite some time now. And um, recently I had a few people reach out to me in private messages uh, about some things that they've noticed on the channel and I thought it was time to address that. Okay, I have said this over and over and over and over again on this channel that the only constant in life is Jesus and change. And when those two come together to change the normal, things can get pretty real pretty fast. You see, my wife and I, we have been serving diligently at the church going on 10 plus years now. Myself, 10 plus years. My wife, she grew up at this church. We met at this church. We married at the church. We were super active in both the worship team, the prayer team, and, and so much more. It was definitely a surprise when we started feeling a gentle tug on our hearts that God was calling us elsewhere. Now, being the stubborn human beings that we are, we decided not to move when that gentle tug happened. And over the course of about a year, God really showed us that he needed us elsewhere. Around March of this year, my wife and I visited a church that a buddy of mine serves at, and I just have to give a huge shout out. Danny, I love you, man. From the moment that the countdown ended and the service officially began, my wife and I knew, just we knew that we had found where we needed to be. Since then, we have been learning and growing in such a deeper way than ever before. When you see the Sunday Sea on this channel, the platform that my wife and I are serving on now. This is redemption. This is the church. A church that believes in simple but meaningful Sundays. A church that practices what they preach when they say, we believe that this is God's church. I will leave links to everything below to the church if you want to learn more. So the question remaining is, why does this matter? Why does this matter to the channel? Us going from one church to another. Well, back to the original statement is the only constant is Jesus and change. And since my family has gone through this transition of leaving one church and attending another, we have learned so much about what does it mean to worship? What does it mean to fulfill the role of a worship drummer? And myself, I've been relearning different aspects of what does it mean to be a worship drummer. And the reason I'm telling you this is because there is definitely an excitement that I cannot wait to share. Thank you so much for um, your patience with some of the content. Thank you so much for um, subscribing to the channel. I really do look forward to gear reviews, uh, covers, more of the Sunday seat and some other collaborations in the works. So thank you so much. We will catch you on the next one.